hello guys so today I'm going to be showing you how to set up two monitors to a single laptop so you have either three displays or two displays you could use just two displays or if you're interested in having like a central display and additional displays you could actually work on it that way so I came across this, it's actually a Dell WD, Dell WD-15, okay, that is what it looks like, it has the power over here, has two USB 3.0 ports in front over here and uh, in the back, it has like a VGA port here has the HDMI port over there, has a USB 3.0 port here, has the power over there, and uh, this is like, it looks like an audio port, okay, and uh, I would actually be making use of this, the 15 pin VGA port and the HDMI port to set up these two monitors that I have over here, okay and uh, the power adapter is actually a 130 watts power adapter that's what it looks like and this is what it looks like the pin is actually a large pin a 7.4 millimeter pin okay and uh, this is the part that connects to the computer so over here we have like it's a usb type c and i happen to have a dell laptop here that has that port so i have like a usb type c port over here on my dell laptop which i'll be connecting this wd15 to okay so uh the first thing you do or the first thing you will need to have to make this possible is You'll need like uh, this 15p VGA pro VGA cable. So it's a male to male. You can see 15 pin male to male cable connection. That's what I'll be using. I'll be making use of that. And I also have a HDMI cable. So it's HDMI to HDMI. Okay. As you can see, I have connected the VGA cable to the WD-15 and the HDMI so these two are connected and the other end one of them is connected to the monitor is connected over here that's the VGA and the other one is connected over here that's the HDMI I've just finished connecting this is the USB type C from the WD-15 I've connected it to the laptop and from the monitors I have over here the VGA coming from one of the monitors to the WD-15 and this is the HDMI coming from the monitor as well to the WD-15 so we have VGA over here we have HDMI over there this is the power power coming from the wall to the WD-15 and this goes to the laptop okay so I'll be putting on the monitors to see if it works so I'll be powering on this is the first monitor the first monitor shows up I power on the next monitor let's see if that works okay so all the monitors are working right now as you can see I will need to set this up in such a way that I can move from one monitor to another so to do that I will go to the laptop and because right now it's just duplicating what is on the laptop to the two monitors so the first thing I do will be to right click I'll right click and uh, I will select display settings 
I right click, select display settings, and I come over here to the right, and I will say extend. I select extend desktop on one and two. Okay. So it's now like an extension. Another thing is that I click on keep changes. I select keep changes. Okay. So it shows us how the display is set up. So one is actually the laptop. Three is the monitor to the right and two is the monitor to the left. So that's actually the setup right now. So this is one, two and three. Okay. So if you feel like changing the setting, you could actually do it. I feel this is kind of like a suitable setting if you want to use all three of them, the laptop and a monitor to the left and the other to the right. So you could decide to close this down and just power them up just on their own and just go ahead and plug in a keyboard over here and you could just use display one and two as you can see. So the laptop is closed. I could decide to just get a keyboard, an external keyboard, connect it over here and this will be like controlling both of the both of the displays okay so another thing that i would like to say is uh this actually makes it so easy in the sense that you could like this can serve as like power you know it charges it charges the laptop i really don't need a laptop charger with this setting so the laptop is constantly charged and I could decide to like power off right here and power on right here as well. So this makes it very comfortable. So I hope this helps. If you have any questions, you could put it in the comments and I will see how I could help answer it. But this is how I'll be setting it up for now. And this is how I hope to use this WD-15. Thank you for watching.